Hey guys, got a homemade tool uh, for my C3 Craftsman collection. Um, I also have a weed eater. But uh, I found this uh, charger on eBay. You can put four batteries in it at one time. And uh, I decided to make a... Uh, it was junk on eBay. I've I seen it and I was like... I always have a problem with like when I go weed eating... Uh, it doesn't, I get about 10, 15 minutes on the weed eater with, well, with a nickel cadmium battery. I haven't yet to try a lithium with the weed eater yet, but, um, I don't really know, I don't really see that these go longer, uh, maybe more consistently, you know, like the charge state stays pretty consistent for the amount of time that you get, but, you know, like these ones here, they kind of wind down. These ones here just kind of shut off. But anyways, um, what I did was, is I made it so that one end has a bum, you know, empty battery. It's just, you know, a plug. And then, uh, plug it into your device. Now, what I want to do with this, I, I want to make it have straps, like, so you can put it on your back. Um, this would be good for, like, you could use it on any of the tools, like, Say um, I was, you know, doing uh, drywall screws or something, or like really heavy screws that uses the battery a lot. You know, I could put this on my back, and then like a backpack, and then I would be able to drill. Um, so you know, there is some inconveniences with the fact that it's still a core, but it is portable power. Um, you can put just one battery in. Oh. Okay, and then you can, you can put two, three, and four batteries in at the same time. The, the, everything seems to run, you know, the, the drill and everything runs at about the same speed. I did notice uh, there is a little bit more power available. Um, where, like, the Sawzall, if you put it on too much of a load, it has, like, something that trips out on it. Whereas when I when it was running with this, I never had noticed it, you know, kicking out. Um, same way with you know the circular saw. Um, you can get a lot of cuts. Um, today we, we was trimming on along the the bank. There's a bunch of little uh, uh, little trees about this big around, or you know this big around. And this thing cut for a couple hours, and then when I went back in to charge the batteries up they was about half charge. They, they wasn't on there. They was only on about half the amount of time. Um, one of the things you could consider too when you're using something, you know, the bigger tools and you're discharging them really fast, batteries get kind of hot where they don't get hot at all running them like this. So you can immediately put them right back on a charge. Um, you don't have to wait for them to cool off. Um, there's diodes. I actually used the circuit board. I don't know if you can see it through these little cracks. But I used the circuit board. I just cut the power supply off of it. And then I cut where all the batteries plug in on the board. I like isolated it, like cutting around the boards to make sure nothing was connected to them. And I actually used the diodes that was on the board. I just switched, the, switched them around so that the, they, you know, the polarity was flopped on them. And uh, each each battery has its own diode, so current can't can't travel from one battery to the other. And also, it remedies for people from trying to like try to plug this into you know the charger and try to trying to charge all four batteries at once. It just would not work. You probably if the charger would even turn on, I don't know, but you could probably overload it. So. Uh, yeah, there's my little tool. I still got, you know, put the straps, you know, I figure I connected to this area here on it. Make like a backpack and kind of anxious to see how it does with the weed eater. Uh, I could go get a, you know, a two-stroke weed eater or whatever, but I don't have a lot of storage, so it makes it handy to have, you know, especially like all one kind of 
you know, power devices, and then, uh, and then, with, like, with this, I've all, from, I'm guessing, I'll probably all do all of my weed eating with four batteries, especially if I get me another, another lithium battery. And so, uh, well, there it is, well, as far as my collection goes, I got, I like to get that, uh, I like to get that little, it's like a fluorescent light stands up. I like to get one of them. And then I also have another drill just like this. And it's like a drill, but it just it comes out and stops right here and goes straight down. The battery goes on. And it's like a for like running screws in or I, I might call them a right angle drill. I would like to get the impact in that light. But I think I even like to have that little shop vac. I mean, with this power supply right here, I mean, it don't have to get an extension cord out, and that little shop vac would be perfect for cleaning out a car and you know not have to drag out a cord. All right, well, guys, well, thanks for watching.